Hello everyone, to my channel. Today we're doing a reading for sign of Sagittarius, and keep in mind that this will not resonate for every Sagittarius. If you like a personal reading, that's going to be down below in the description. We can find that on my website. You can also find a bunch of other things there on the website too, and it's free to sign up and join. Let's go ahead and go check it out. But let's see what we have going on for Sagittarius today. The Ten of Pentacles! <laughs> we're starting off with the Ten of Pentacles, Sagittarius. All right. Ten of Pentacles is a really nice card. You want to know why? Because it's the card with a lot of money. <laughs> That's what's coming your way is a lot of money. On this card, there's the money, there's the family, there's the home, and there's the dogs. It's overall abundance. It's overall stability. And it's what's coming your way. You're about to have a lot of abundance coming in, Sagittarius. All this abundance is rushing towards you. All this money, and I feel like you have happiness. You have happiness. You have your stability. You have your abundance. You have your money here, your family, all that stuff, right? And you have your happiness. And we have your Ten of Cups, Sagittarius. Ten of Cups, Ten of Pentacles. These are probably like the, the two best cards you can get. And that's what we start your reading off with. So it's like you're really, you're really super blessed or about to be super blessed here. But the Ten of Cups is, it, it can be also the happy relationship coming your way, the happy marriage, the happy family, happy all of that. But overall, what's, what makes you happy is what's coming your way. And it may be success. It may be victory. It may be a, like a big breakthrough moment for you, Sagittarius. Alright, some of you guys may have Capricorn in your birth chart, but you have justice. See, I feel like this is your good karma um, that you've you've put out there. See, this is what's coming back around to you, is your good karma, Sagittarius. And, once again, you got your money coming in. There's a lot of money coming in for you. So let's see more. Let's see more for Sagittarius. You're completing out old cycles of the past, and you're making a decision on what you're doing now. So you got your money, you're cleaning out old cycles. What are you going to do after that? What are you going to do? What do you want to do? That's a question. Some of you guys may be doing, like, charity work. Maybe you're getting into charity work. Maybe you're doing a new idea. Maybe you're creating something new. Maybe you're getting into your creative side after this Sagittarius here. There's also, the like... There's the Seven of Swords. There's somebody here coming in with an offer, but it's like a false love offer. Maybe two people doing this, because I see there's two people on this wheel. There's the Seven of Swords and that of Cups with the Fool. There's somebody here that I feel like is, is coming in. There's two people coming in with a false love offer towards you, Sagittarius, but I, I feel like you know that this is... You know their intentions. Alright. So once again, it feels like you're just leaving that alone. I feel like you're not really taking that seriously. Yeah, you're ignoring it. You're like, no, get out of here. You know, you're releasing it, Sagittarius. And you're releasing people that are sneaky, people here that are manipulative. Queen of Wands. The Queen of Wands is yourself, whether you're male or female. Does not matter, but I feel like what you're investing into is going to be paying off for you, and you're getting everything that you've been wishing for, Sagittarius, once again. And there's there may be nine different things that you're wishing for, that are coming in for you, okay? It's happening. It's happening. Your abundance is happening. We got, we got everything you've been wishing for. What have, you know, some of you guys have been wishing for financial freedom, financial independence here, financial abundance, and it feels like that's what's coming in for you here, Sagittarius. Yeah, I feel like it's financial... Stability, or if you're already financial, financially stable, becoming more financially abundant. See, once again, what you're investing into is paying off for you. And once again, you're going to be getting everything you've been wishing for. What you're expecting is coming in. You have three ships you've been expecting. They are coming in, Sagittarius. This is just, once again, this is your good karma coming back around to you. This is success. This is victory. Right, Sagittarius? You're ascending. You're moving forward here. You're moving forward towards success. You're moving forward towards victory here. Some of you guys are getting enough money to buy the car. The car you've been wanting to buy. You know what I'm saying here? But either way, 
the point is you're going to be getting everything you've been wishing for and you're stepping up as the emperor even though the emperor is not normally your card in tarot you're embodying the emperor today sagittarius is what it feels like for you your your business is expanding here your empire is growing here sagittarius you're you're expanding and once again you see you have ships you've been waiting for that are coming in for you and it feels like it's coming in threes there's three things I mean, there's a three of swords don't like the three of swords but there's happiness you see maybe there was hurt before in the pain in the past whatever but now you're moving forward towards happiness sagittarius moving towards what makes you happy here okay You overcame every obstacle that was in your way. Some of you guys may have removed some two people out of your life. Once again, may have been those two people that were coming with false love offers towards you, trying to be difficult or whatever, and I feel like you may have kicked them out of your life. Once again, Sagittarius, where are the cards I want to use? Where do they go? They're underneath these cards. All right, so since we were talking about your business earlier, we're going to grab these advice cards for you, and we're going to see more for you. So let's see. Plan. I gotta make a plan, Sagittarius. Alright, so make a business plan here. Design. Build a simple and elegant website that attracts buyers who love and engage with your brand. So some of you guys may need to build a website here, or maybe make your website a little bit better here where it's gonna attract in buyers if you do have a business flow. Get more done by entering the flow state. Completely and joyfully focus on what you're working on without multitasking. Yeah, so get get something, get a plan on, it, like, organize things better where it flows better, Sagittarius, is what I feel like for you. Manage, managing your time more wisely. Yeah, so this is, this is so you have more, more time to do what you need to do or what you want to do. Manage your time wisely. Delegate or outsource tasks that drain your energy and do tasks that are in your realm of unique brilliance. Alright. Now, we're going to go back over here, because those were the advice. Yeah, there may be two people you're blocking, Sagittarius, and you're deciding to commit yourself, you're committing yourself to something here, but this, what you're committing to is, is kind of like the unknown for you in a bit here. And I feel like this is part of your expansion. You're expanding, but you kind of are leaping into the unknown at the same time. It's kind of like you don't fully know <laughs> what you're doing, but you're figuring it out. And there may be people coming in wanting to work with you, wanting to collaborate with you. Sagittarius, the star. Maybe there's an Aquarius wanting to work with you here. All right, is what I feel like for you. And once again, you guys are moving forward towards a new beginning in your life here. And life's about to pick up for you. Life's about to move fast for you. Get ready. Get ready for your dreams to come in fast, Sagittarius. Let's go over here and let's see more. You're seeing the bigger picture now. I feel like you're seeing what is going to help you bring your dreams in. Right? What Or what is going to bring you justice as well in your life here. What steps to take, Sagittarius? Yeah, you're making a plan, okay? You're making a plan here, and you're manifesting this, okay? Some of you guys may need to go outside at night. Go speak out your wishes at night, because there's a night star goddess wanting to connect with you. But I feel like this is a new beginning for you. You're manifesting a new beginning. You're manifesting your hopes, your dreams, your desires, everything you've been wanting, new opportunities. A lot of you guys are also tapping into your psychic side as well. Once you guys are manifesting wealth on all levels coming to you, Sagittarius, all right? And you're using your intuition towards these steps again. And you've got love coming in. All right, Sagittarius, there's also love. There may be love coming in. Maybe you end up projecting the love. Maybe you're like, I don't really want this. You guys got a new money opportunity coming your way too. Here, your heart desires is what's coming in. And once again, there's a lot of money coming your guys' way. You guys got options, what you can do with your, you know, your income streams here. Don't overthink things. You're going to be fine. But I feel like you're deciding to commit yourself towards what you want in your life. You're committing 
to taking action towards your ideal lifestyle. Okay, guys, you guys gotta stop having anxiety. You're gonna be fine. Okay, life's gonna work out fine for you, man. Once again, there's love coming your way, Sagittarius. There's somebody here that views you as the empress, or some of you guys can have an empress coming your way here. All right. And there's somebody here coming in to communicate with you, Star. Once again, it could be Aquarius. There's somebody here wanting to be with you, but I feel like you're not really wanting to be with them. Is the thing, Sagittarius. I feel like you feel a bit distant towards them here, and I feel like they're coming in wanting to talk to you, wanting to be with you, wanting to do other, and I feel like you're just busy doing other things in your life. You're like, I have something here I'm trying to do. Not really interested in love at the moment, and that's what I feel like for you, but I feel like you are accomplishing your dreams. You are doing what you want to do, and you're about to get super blessed, okay? So, Sagittarius. That is what I have for you. If you want to see more content for your sign, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. You can also find even more content on my website, too. Alright, so goodbye, guys.